So which wrestler did I get in Topps Living Set? Let's open this up and find out. So this is what the packaging looks like inside. Very well packaged. And the wrestler I got in the Topps Living Set is... We'll have to wait a second. Well, I will say it's very well packaged here. And I got The Rock in Topps WWE Living Set. That is an awesome looking card of The Rock. So Topps has been creating these living sets for a while. They've been doing it for baseball for a good bit. And if you're new to the concept, it is a set that never ends. And, well, it will eventually be ending since Topps is going to be kind of getting out of the whole business. But currently, it's just a set that is going on and on. So every week, they release some new cards, like, uh think two per week uh, and they do it for wrestling star wars and baseball are the ones i'm familiar with and so they just recently started up with the wrestling cards and uh i've been waiting patiently for a uh, release of the rock now this is number 82 in the set and what's really cool is they only print how many cards um, that are ordered. So in the case of The Rock, if I'm not mistaken, there was 3,671 of these cards uh, made. There is no like serial number on here saying that. Um, you have to look it up. So if you come across any living set cards, um, they have this kind of painted type image of the person on there. Um, it, it, the print runs can really vary. Now, in the wrestling set, um, if it's not a star wrestler for the most part, the print runs are well under a thousand. Um, and some of the bigger names they have released um, are a little bit higher than that, with The Rock, I think, being kind of the most popular. But even under 3,700, that's not a huge print run considering how immensely popular The Rock is. So if you have a certain person that you are a big fan of, whether it's in baseball or Star Wars or WWE, keep an eye on the living sets. Um, I picked up some Watani rookie card, a rookie card off of there too. Um, and so it's kind of a sneaky way to uh, pick up a card of one of your favorite people with not an incredibly high print run and um, maybe down the road make a little bit of money off of it later on down the road. So hope everyone's doing well. Until next time, be good.